Hi, I was recently asked, how do you sharpen instruments that look like a spoon or a scoop? Um, so I'm gonna demonstrate on one of Trish O'Hare's instruments where it has the sickle on one end and then the little scooped end on the other end. So it's a, it's, it's a little challenging because what you have to do is figure out where the cutting edge is and what angle it's at. So this is what I would suggest is have this lower shank be parallel to the floor and then look to see where that cutting edge actually is meeting the face and the back. So I'm, I'm gonna call the scooped part the face. And so what, I think the easiest way to do this is how I teach people to sharpen the toe, is bring your stone up to the instrument at a 90 degree angle like this, actually touch the end of the instrument and then slowly open it up and you're gonna see where the cutting edge now is meeting the stone. If you go farther than that, you can see that the cutting edge is off of the stone. So bring your stone back up where you see it on the cutting edge. Just uh, That's what I see. It's gonna be super hard to show you up close, but um, my stone is right on the cutting edge. If I go too far like this, Again, it's, it's um, opened up and now my stone is not touching the cutting edge. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna slowly close it till I see it meet that cutting edge. And then I'm gonna start sharpening. Sharpen this section until dust appears. Once dust appears, start coming around the curve. I'm coming around the curve towards my body right now. Keeping the stone up against the angle of the cutting edge. Okay, that feels good. Now I'm gonna come around to the cutting edge. It's kind of facing you right now at the camera. I'm gonna sharpen that until dust appears. Okay, now I want to check it. See if it's, yep, it's shaving the, it's ch shaving the test stick. Oh, that's good. It's shaving it really well. So it doesn't take much to sharpen these little babies. <laughs> so I hope that helped. Um, if you have any questions, if that didn't answer the questions that you may have about how to sharpen spoon-shaped instruments, then please feel free to uh, email me at Deborah, D-E-B-O-R-A-H, at D-H cubed, that's D-H-C-U-B-E-D dot com. And I'd be happy to get back to you and answer any questions that you may have. Okay, have fun sharpening out there. Bye.